eight of the 14 players on the St. Joseph's College Brooklyn men's basketball team played in the local Catholic League. And of those eight, four come directly from St. Edmund Prep. Junior forwards David Luizon and Chris Labati and sophomore guards Matt O'Neill and Greg Beeler were all once St. Edmund's Eagles. The Eagles basketball program is always competitive and routinely sends student athletes to play ball in college. When you're getting kids from a Catholic school, you know that they've gotten the fundamentals down. You know they've been coached properly. It makes it a lot easier for us. Now playing as Bears, the quartet of former Eagles still employs aspects of their game that they learned at St. Edmunds. It taught me great values of hard work, uh, to, to never stop working, to just keep keep at it. Starting from freshman year when Mr. Wagner, junior, uh, sophomore year, O'Brien, and then from Wiatry, it was great. They're all three great coaches. They all taught me certain things. and. I bring it on the court and I got it from Edmonds, nowhere else. Just confidence. You need, you need to have confidence to be a good player. Um, and I learned that every year I played, you know, uh, confidence grew each year. And um, that's one thing you need to play with. It helped us a great deal because it taught us that prep school means that preparing us for college. So St. Edmonds really helped me towards going to St. Joseph's. Adjusting to life as a college basketball player could be a challenge but it certainly helps to be surrounded by a few familiar faces. It's not strictly about winning, it's not win or else. You know, it's, it's the experience. It's a four year experience that these guys could look back on and be thankful. Of course, their relationship prior is definitely beneficial to them. Well, St. Edmunds, much like St. Joseph's, is a very small school. So being there, the, the theme was family. Everything we did was about being a family. It's great on the court and off the court. On the court, we just know what we're going to do. We know the nuances of each other's games. We know when they're going to shoot, um, when they're going to pass. And it's just great working together. Chemistry is a huge part of basketball. And I love having my St. Edmund guys next to me. I was only with them for one year, my junior year. But having them on the team is great. They're, they're leaders on the court. And to play with them on this court feels great because it's like nothing ever changed. It's like basically we have that. Uh, obviously, that means people came over. But it's like, it's like our friendship never died. We all knew each other, so we were comfort, comfortable around each other, and um, you know we got to, to know each other. You know we got to know the other guys pretty well. In my two varsity, I used to have David on my side when I started with him, so it was really like nothing new to me. We just played together. We have great chemistry, so I felt right at home. I actually wear my Eagles practice gear almost every day, and uh, I've never let that go. I've carried that with me um, every day in practice, and we're always mentioning it. We go at it with other guys that we played against in high school, and it's just this wonderful Edmonds bond. These four basketball players may now identify themselves as Bears, but deep down, they'll always be St. Edmund Prep Eagles. Reporting for Currents, I'm Jim Mancari.